Hey, Mrs. Reese's Glass, it's Mr. Papacino here. Uh, Mrs. Reese invited me to read a story to you today. So I'm in my backyard. You can see, got my bird feeders over here, squirrel feeders, and I'm gonna read you one of my favorite stories. It's called, Are You My Mother? by P.D. Eastman. Are you my mother? I wonder what kind of characters we'll find in this story. Let's see. A mother bird sat on her egg. wonder why she's sitting on that egg. What is she doing? Is she keeping it warm? The egg jumped. Uh-oh, said the mother bird. My baby will be here. He will want to eat. Is she going to have to get him some food? Where is she going to go? Is she going to go to the grocery store? Hmm. I must get something for my baby bird to eat, she said. I will be back. She left her baby. So away she went. Oh, look at her fly off. She's gonna go find some food. I wonder what she's gonna look for. What do you think a baby bird would like to eat? Hmm. Bowl of ice cream, cereal. The egg jumped. It jumped and it jumped. Out came the baby bird. Oh, look at that cute baby bird. How do you think the baby feels? Where's his mom? Where's my mother, he said. He looked for her. Ooh. What is he going to do? He looked up. He did not see her. He looked down. He did not see her. I will go and look for her, he said. So away he went. Uh-oh. Is he stepping off his nest? Is he going to fall? Let's see what happens. Down out of the tree he went. Down, down, down. It was a long way down. Uh-oh. I think he's okay. The baby bird could not fly. He could not fly, but he could walk. Now I will go and find my mother, he said. Let's hope he finds his mom. He did not know what his mother looked like. He went right by her. He did not see her. Oh, what is she getting him? Is she getting him some food? What is that? Is that a worm? A squishy worm? <laughs> he came to a kitten. Are you my mother? He said to the kitten. The kitten just looked and looked. It did not say a thing. What do cats say? Cats meow. The kitten was not his mother, so he went on. Then he came to a hen. Are you my mother? He said to the hen. No, said the hen. The hen kind of looks like him. Is the hen a bird? The kitten was not his mother. The hen was not his mother, so the baby bird went on. I have to find my mother, he said. But where? Where is she? Where could she be? Then he came to a dog. What do dogs say? They bark. Are you my mother? He said to the dog. I'm not your mother. I'm a dog, said the dog. He doesn't look like a bird. Birds of feathers, right? The kitten was not his mother. The hen was not his mother. The dog was not his mother. So the baby bird went on. Now he came to a cow. What do cows say? They moo. That's right. Are you my mother? He said to the cow. How could I be your mother? Said the cow. I am a cow. This is a good story, I like this. We need to thank Mrs. Reese for letting me read to you today. The kitten and the hen were not his mother. The dog and the cow were not his mother. Did he have a mother? How do you think he feels right now? Yeah, he might be a little sad. Oh, these are tough pages. 
I did have a mother, said the baby bird. I know I did. I have to find her. I will. I will. He's determined he's going to find his mom. Where will she be? Now the baby bird did not walk. He ran. Then he saw a car. Could that old thing be his mother? No, it could not. The baby bird did not stop. He ran on and on. Look at that old car. What color is that car? Is it yellow? Now he looked way down, way down. He saw a boat. There she is, said the baby bird. He called to the boat, but the boat did not stop. The boat went on. What kind of noise does a boat make? Maybe a big foghorn? He looked way, way up, and he saw a big plane. Here I am, mother, he called out. But the plane did not stop. The plane went on. What type of noise does a plane make? A big jet flying through the sky. Just then, the baby bird saw a big thing. This must be his mother. There she is, he said. There is my mother. Is that his mother? What is that? Anybody know what that is? Is that for building and digging? He ran right up to it. Mother, mother, here I am, mother, he said to the big thing. Is it gonna answer him back? What will it say? But the big thing just said, snort. Oh, you are not my mother, said the baby bird. You are a snort. I have to get out of here. Ooh, looks like he's in the bucket. Is he in the bucket? But the baby bird could not get away. The snort went up. It went way, way up, 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 up. It went with the baby bird. Ooh. Think he's afraid of heights? I don't think birds are afraid of heights. But now, where was the snort going? Oh, 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 what is the snort going to do to me? Get me out of here. Is he scared? I think he might be scared, but that's okay. Just then, the snort came to a stop. What's the snort gonna do? What's gonna happen? You predict, and you guess what's gonna happen next. Where am I, said the baby bird. I wanna go home. I want my mother. Oh, what a long day. He's hungry and he can't find his mom. And then something happened. The snort put that baby bird right back in the tree. The baby bird was home. Oh, finally. But he still needs his mom. Just then, the mother bird came back to the tree. Do you know who I am? She said to her baby. Oh, what's he going to say? What is that baby bird going to say? He's having a tough time with his pages. <laughs> yes, I know who you are, said the baby bird. You are not a kitten. You are not a hen. You are not a dog. You are not a cow. You are not a boat or a plane or a snort. You are a bird and you are my mother. <laughs> the end. Isn't that a great book? That's Are You My Mother by Petey Eastman. I hope you guys enjoyed that. Have a great day.